Welcome to the Total Container Solutions instructional videos. Applying the coating. Open the polythene and staple along the edges of the container. We don't recommend masking the side walls. The overspray will cover the top six inches of the walls. This is the only area that tends to condense. Dress in your personal protective equipment, ready to spray. Connect your airline and compressor to the gun. Using the jug provided, half fill the hopper. Starting at the back wall with the gun roughly 450 mm 18 inches away from the roof, open the air tap and begin to spray. Work backwards to around halfway along the container then turn around and spray the opposite corrugation from the reverse angle. This method keeps the sprayer out of the overspray. Then complete the second half of the container. Once finished, inspect the coverage and thicken any thin areas. A 20-foot container will require 18 kilograms of graphotherm, so use any graphotherm that is left until it has all been sprayed. This will give an average thickness of around 1.5 millimeters. Remove the polythene from the rear to the front folding over the wet overspray. Allow both doors and the ventilation holes are clear to enable cyclic drying of the coating. Ensure the graphotherm is thoroughly dry. When applying graphotherm when either frost or condensation are possible, the coating must be force dried using a large space heater. During the summer months, the coating can dry naturally.